Have you ever felt guilty or ashamed at your inability to stop your out-of-control food cravings? You feel like it's your fault, like you're to blame, like you know better. But no matter what you do, they just keep coming back and you can't stop them. They're relentless. They just keep returning. I need to tell you something very important right now. It's not your fault. You've been conditioned to crave. Let me explain yourself. When you first tasted sugar or processed food for the first time, you felt this immense reward, satisfaction, and pleasure. It was your brain. You know, in fact, the part of your brain that's responsible for your emotional well-being and your survival has actually been threatened by these processed foods. And your brain is now associated with these foods with survival, with relief. And so you keep going back to them to change. And then on top of that, on top of that response, there's something called the bliss point. And what the bliss point is, is the perfect combination of sugar, salt, fat, and other ingredients that elicits a maximum response of pleasure, a maximum response of relief. And sugar is the gateway drug. You've been conditioned to crave. And conditioned means that you've been trained or influenced to think about the things you crave automatically, as if you're completely stuck on autopilot and you can't turn it off. This is not your fault. But you can change your brain through neuroplasticity. And on that note, I wanted to tell you that because of your retirement sugar-free challenge, During this month, we are going to be offering you free, 100% free access to the Get Out of the Food System, which is our brand new and effective way to figure out how you need to eat to crush your cravings and sustainably give you the energy you need to live the life you want. And in the next video, we're going to be dive even deeper into this so you can get the results you really want.